It was a cold, dark night. The wind howled outside. I could not feel the cold. My companion came to me. He told me to get up, to get some food, some water, stretch my legs. I did not. Then, with a huge gust of wind, our barn wall fell. And I remembered a little thing we call hope. And I slowly began to rise. One day, a fool came to our barn. She was very cute and very excited as well. What, what, what's this barn like, you guys? What is it like? It's very abusive. What does abusive mean? You'll find out. But I want to know. You will, but only time can tell you. So, days passed. Stupid humans tried to give us a new wall. Fencing. They thought they could hold us in. But of course they couldn't. We were waiting. Then the fool said, I'm really hungry. When do I get my food? You don't get food around here. But I thought this was a barn. Not really. It's more like a slaughterhouse. A waterhouse? Nothing. Nothing at all. Just go rest. All right, that works for me. Sundance? Yes. I'm scared. I... I want to get out of here. Come on. Oh, I thought I told you to go to bed. Don't worry, we'll work on getting out of this place. Okay. These boards are so strong. Keep at it, Sundance. I know you can do it. I did it! I got us out! Come on, let's go! I got us way out! Sundance, I'm sorry. She couldn't hold on much longer. I'm so sorry. I felt my life had no use. That fool had given me a purpose, to try to break her out. Then the humans came the next day, found her dead body. They didn't even bury her, just threw her somewhere. The next day, they took us across down to city, a place we've never been before. It was frightening. Then we were loaded upon this big thing. It was like a ship or it something. It went across deep waters. It was like it could fly across the water. It gave us the weirdest sensation of I, floating. I, I knew something was wrong. It was just not right for them to let us just go out and go somewhere. Even if we were going there against our will. Usually they would hold us here. Mm. 